Alright, well that was fun. Uh, I just finished recording the last of the vlog from last night because apparently I completely spaced on it. I got so involved in, in editing video and, and shooting video at about, what, 8.45 or something, I, I ran downstairs after my son went to bed, shot some video, <laughs> and just edited until uh, after midnight. And then I passed out, ran upstairs, and I was just out completely. Apparently, my wife woke up in the middle of the night like four times. I didn't even notice. So yeah, heading into work, I'm going to try to finish up the video between um, going home over lunch and then going home right after work and try to have it rendered and, and uploading by 5 o'clock, uh, hopefully. That's best case scenario. Worst case, it might be even later. But I put up a video yesterday, so if I can do one again today, and then hopefully shoot one tonight to put up tomorrow, I, I'm just taking it one day at a time. I'm not going to do one of those, you know, I'm going to make five videos this week promises, because inevitably that will fall through, because it happens every single time. But if I do it one day at a time, you know, very easily, here's... You know, here's a video I'm going to make for tomorrow. Here's a video I'm going to make for tomorrow, and so on and so forth. It should work out for the best. So yeah, I am on my way back from lunch now, and I've realized that the half-hour lunch that I get per day, it's just not enough to be able to do anything other than eat. And that's just a shame. Because for a while there, I was actually going home, and I was making videos, and, you know, shooting and editing, and all sorts of fun stuff, and then I would grab lunch and take it back. But in doing that, that's kind of unfair to my work. And uh, I, I don't want to don't want to do that anymore. So I've been going home and having lunch, and then I look down and oh look, it's been 35 minutes. I've got to run back to work now. So for the time being, the majority of editing that I can do, the majority of filming I can do, is going to be after work and late in the evenings. But other than that, a little bit of good news, hopefully. I, I've been talking for a while, mostly to myself, a little bit on the live shows, about the possibility of investing in some better lighting for my videos, because currently I use like a $12 heat lamp from, from Lowe's that I picked up a while back, and it works adequately, but uh, I don't know, just not great. The, uh, the light is inconsistent, it sort of flickers just a little bit, uh, enough so that it's, it's not the exact same amount of light the entire video. Uh, so, basically, I went on to Adorama.com, I've used them a couple of times before for stuff, and they have these uh, compact fluorescent uh, swirly bulb lights with a softbox over them, and they're relatively inexpensive. So I went ahead and ordered one. Hopefully it will be here in a few days. It uh, said it actually shipped already, and uh, when that comes, I will probably do an unboxing and a, a quick demonstration, because I searched YouTube, and there's nothing regarding this specific light out there. So maybe this could be could be good for everybody in the long run look at that it's turned into an absolutely gorgeous afternoon I'm actually headed home right now I'm gonna be editing for the foreseeable future until I get the arch install tutorial done at the very least so I actually spent a little bit of time in the YouTube forums this afternoon if you haven't been there before for the most part there's a lot of why can't I become a partner or uh, what's wrong with my account what's what's wrong with this feature I hate this new feature blah 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 but one thread caught my eye this afternoon and it was basically some guy complaining about the amount of ads on videos and, and that there are ads that show up over top of the videos and the only thing that I would have to say in response to that and I did post a comment on it was it's a free website you've got to expect ads the fact that there are not ads on a large number of videos says a lot about the site itself and the fact that the ads that they do put out there, somebody other than just Google and YouTube are receiving the money, somebody else is receiving at least a portion of it, that really says a lot about it. I mean, just a few years ago, uh, YouTube didn't have the partner program, and people were just uploading videos just for fun, and it's really turned a turned 180. It's, it's made significant changes, and it's made a lot of people uh, uh, it's an extra source of income at the very least. You know, for me, so far, it's not been anything outlandish, but it's definitely, uh, it, it's been a little bit extra. It's been enough to, to help keep the hardware going or, or upgrading little by little. It's nothing that I'm going to be able to, to stop working on or anything like that. But uh, I don't know. I don't normally like to, to go into money, and I'm definitely not going into specifics on anything like that. But I just thought it was a little bit, a little bit odd to complain about something that's free, just because it has ads. I mean, the way that I put it was, you have paid television, probably. Do you have cable or satellite? 
then you're paying to watch the television, and you're also paying to watch the ads. Why are you complaining about this free service? Hey guys, it's the end of the night. I'm actually in a different part of the house, and I'm being quiet because everybody else is asleep. I spent the majority of the night editing video and managed to get it all done. It's 18 minutes long, and you will probably see it before you see this if it finishes rendering because it's going to take over two hours to render it. So fingers crossed, and hopefully I can upload it tomorrow morning. Good night, guys.